What's up everybody and welcome to a brand new series. I'm playing an adventure map called Planetary Confinement. It is essentially, um, I'm, I'm live streaming during this also, so you may see some stuff, but that's not really important. Nonetheless, it's like if any of you guys have heard of the adventure map Crash Landing, a lot of the popular YouTubers did that, and it's going to be like that. So I think essentially I'm playing the hard mode version. You can find links in the description to the map. It's a 2000 by 2000 map, it has custom terrains, quests, and all that jazz. I'm sure you guys will kind of figure it out as the time goes on. Again, as I said, I'm live streaming, so if you see me like reference off screen to chat and uh, or anything like that, um, well, that's that's what I, that's why I'm doing it because it's during a live stream. I'm actually gonna turn up the master volume a bit. I don't want to make it too loud, but I want to be able to hear things. You know what I mean? I'm actually gonna turn it down a lot. <laughs> um, but yes, so I've read the bare minimum about this map because something I want to do is kind of go in a tad bit blind. Like I want to know the basics of what's going on, but I don't want to know too much. So as you can see, we're in this spaceship. We did crash land into a uh, into a desert. And, oh yeah, and this is completely vanilla. I, I think I should have mentioned that. I got an achievement there, taking inventory. So, um, lost quest book. So I'm going to open this book, and here we go. Quest 1, room to breathe. Rewards, one compass, one water bottle. Objective. Your onboard, com oh. Your onboard computer has detected that the atmosphere outside this ship is not breathable. Acquire the space helmet and equip it to your head slot. So, um, is this it? No, this is, this is not it. Uh, oh. But, oh, I was like, I think I just lost it. How do you use these things? I can't get it off. Oh, no. Okay. Okay, what is this thing? Boop. Oh, I did it. So, quest complete, room to breathe. That was like, see, this is fun. I like this whole quest thing. So, I did complete the quest, and we're going to have to go back to the quest book. Open the hatch. So, reward, one-time bucket. The ship's airlock has been damaged and cannot keep the cabin pressurized after you open it. Luckily, you have enough oxygen to last you. Open the airlock so you can see what you're up against in this barren planet. So, I don't know if I'm supposed to do this, but I'm going to put in all the spacesuit stuff, because, you know, I'm not taking any risks with this stuff. And uh, we do have a compass and all that. Is there anything in this chest? I don't, I'm going to just leave this stuff be. There's a redstone rifle in there. I don't even know what that is. But uh, here we go. We're going to open the airlock. Oh. This is scary. So I did get my bucket. And uh, we're going to take a little look around. It looks like this is where the crash light did occur. So we're going to gonna observe here. It is on hardcore, so I got to be careful. What the hell is that? Oh, my God. Oh my god. So I have, as you can see on the side, I have a hydration and a temperature bar, so we gotta be extra careful. If I click this airlock button again. Oh god, it doesn't close. This is horrible. Okay, so we're gonna be very careful. We're gonna check out what this says. Glinting in the dust. One water bottle we'll get. So obviously we have to keep ourselves cool and keep ourselves hydrated with the water bottles and all that. Your ship's onboard crafting module is offline. It appears to have clogged with debris from the crash, but you cannot open it without a key card. Uh, check around the ship. It must be around somewhere. So we have to find a key card. Um, fluid extractor. A redstone rife. What is this? Um, oh, around the ship as in outside, I'm guessing. So we're going to look around here. I'm not going to run because I don't. we don't have a reliable source of food just yet. So I want to be a little bit careful about that. Um, I don't see a key card though. Does anyone, right? I, unless I'm missing it. Uh, oh, that's probably it. Um, what is this? Crafting module key card. All right, cool. So we got glinting in the dust. We have a bunch of water. So this, these are all regular water bottles. I don't know if, I think there might be dirty water and stuff too. Restore function, 10 times bone meal. Ooh, that's going to be really helpful. So, with the keycard in hand, access the crafting module and clear out the debris from inside. There should be also an emergency crafting module crafting guide inside. Emergency crafting module crafting guide inside. That's a uh, mouthful. So, we'll place this in here. And, oh, so it looks like we cleared out the debris. And now we're going to have to open this stuff. And we'll see what's in here. So, we have an emergency crafting guide and we have one dirt. And uh, I feel like that dirt's actually going to be really important. So what's this say? Hello, space traveler. If you're reading this guide, then your ship's onboard computer has detected a critical error in your crafting module. Worry not, though, for your crafting module has it. Wait, is this like a? What's the next quest? Getting wood. Okay, so yeah, we're gonna read the crafting thing. Um, so 
for your credit has uh when your crafting module is in emergency failsafe mode your crafting recipes will be limited to only those which are deemed necessary for survival on hostile hostile worlds the emergency failsafe ensures no internal ow no internal power is wasting during the crafting it shouldn't be wasted during in the crafting process in order to ensure this new item can only be crafted on a one at a time do not place more than one item in the acm slot this guide will show you the recipes which you are still craftable in your dire situation. Once again, remember not to place more than one item slash block in any crafting module slot. Also, do not place any place items in empty slots of a recipe as it will be lost. Craft carefully. Okay, so the crafting guide is emergency module fire safe recipe guide. Online guide. Click the button above to be taken to the online guide. It's easier with full picture message. Highly recommended for players with internet access. Well, obviously, I don't want to do that because... Um, I'm on here, so it looks like, oh, so we have cobblestone, so it looks like you're going to get, like, this dust stuff. Should I just open the online guide? I guess I will. And it takes me to an image. That's kind of interesting. Um, huh. So it's just basically a bunch of stuff. It shows you how to get certain things. So oak planks, uh, oh, you get logs the same way. Oh, what's this? Tools. Bone crook? The three bones will make bone crooks. Shears you get from... Wait, no, that's a hoe. So shears you'll get from two iron. Looks like that's all the same. Items and materials, food and drink. This is important, actually. So bread's the same. What is this? Seasoned flesh. I don't know. All right, so we're going to go... Oh, my God, that's loud. So we're going to go to this getting wood. Rewards two times saplings, ten times... Use the dirt you cleared out from the crafting module to plant a sapling. Collect some logs when it has grown. Wait, what? How do I, how do I, how do I get a set? I could plant it. I'm going to put this, I'm, I'm scared to like do anything. So I'm just going to put this right there. How do I, do I have to, wait, what? Two times half, getting wood. Use the dirt you cleared out from the crafting module to plant a sapling. Collect some logs when it has grown. Uh, how do I get a sapling? Oh, oh, <laughs> okay, this makes sense. All right, so we got this. We're going to have to use this sapling. That is not very clear. That's okay, though. So what we're going to do is run back over this way. You know, yeah, I don't know if I said developer of the map. Um, I don't know. I forget. Did I? It, well, nonetheless, developer of the map is Samsaurus. Samosaurus. So dinosaur, TBT, and uh, we're going to grow the... Ah, ah. What? What? What the hell is this? No, I don't like this. I don't like this. Why? And I'm in slow motion too. Is that too loud? That might be too loud. But, oh my god. This is bad. This is really bad. My hydration is lowering, as you can see on the side there. So, uh, yeah, everything's in slow motion. So, using that bone meal on the sapling is clearly not the most advantageous thing for me. Oh my god, what is this? Is there like a simpler way to do this? I feel like there might be a simpler way. Wait, what if I jump up on a block? Can they climb blocks? Oh my god, no, they can, they can, they can. Okay, that was a bad idea. That was a bad idea, very bad idea. And, uh, alright, so we're fine, we're fine. We're just gonna continue to punch these dudes, whatever they are. Um, I don't, I don't know what, what occurred. They don't seem to die very easily. So that is not good. I am, I, I feel like time is slowly speeding up more and more though. So, the slow motionness will be away shortly. And can I, am I really punching two at a time? That's crazy. All right, so, oh, we killed one. We killed one. So I imagine they got to be pretty close to dying, all of them. Because I don't think any single one is that, had like that much, it was that much stronger. All right, so yeah, two of them are dead. This is good. We're gaining some experience on this, actually. I am losing food, though, and I did just get hit by one, so that sucks, because this is hardcore. And I'm going to go explore whatever that thing is, because I just accidentally walked by it, and it didn't seem to attack me. So, plus we've been in, like, we're, we're battle hardened now. We could take on the world. Oh my god, no! No! What the hell? This one attacked me. Okay, so we've cleared out nearly all of them. Oh my god. Oh my god. Stop taking damage. Oh my god. Why is this one not. This one's not dying. Oh my god. I already took three and a half hearts of damage, though. That's really bad. Okay, we killed it. Get the experience. We're going to travel over this way and check out whatever the hell this thing is. They're bones. 
I don't know, those bones, those bones don't seem to want to move. But, uh, yeah, so I got some bones. I'm just going to put that in there. Mining fatigue ends in zero seconds. All right, so we should be back. So I can, okay, everything's back to normal. We're out of food, though. So what the hell? Is that, like, always happen like that? Clearly not. Oh, God. All right, so we finished that. Getting wood. Uh, use the declare. Oh, so I have to get some wood now. So, we'll oh my God, that was horrible. Let's let's never do that again. Um, yeah, I don't I I don't know. That was okay. So we can completed the class getting wood. I'm gonna finish this off. We're gonna have to grab all the saplings from this. Oh, I already got two, but ah, oh, that was horrible. That was like terrifying. And uh, yeah, I don't even know, man. I, I like I don't. I don't even know that like is that some, does that happen all I, I imagine that is like a random chance when using bone meal for that thing to appear or something I don't know because that seems very difficult to be early on I would have took the gun if I would have known that was gonna happen but I, I, I was unaware so we'll continue to uh, smash this stuff and uh, hopefully I don't think we've actually gotten a sapling yet, so that may be bad. Um, I'm actually going to lower the sound a bit because I feel like it's a bit loud. And we'll go like that. And, oh, we did get one. Sorry, so that, no, we got a couple actually. Oh, all right, so that paid off. All right, so getting thirsty, one times water bottle. Use nine saplings to craft a mass sapling. What? Oh, I didn't make more. All right, here we go, round two. <laughs> Oh my god. What? It just took 15 bone meal? How is that legal? What do I do? Oh wait, use nine. Then place the mess. How? How do I get a mess sapling if it took all my bone meal? Oh wait, I have this bone. Okay, we're fine. There you go. Seriously, though, that took, like, more bone meal than I feel. Like, that took 21 bone meal. That is that normal? Oh, we got a big tree on this one. This is actually kind of cool. Um, I feel like it's going to be very difficult to uh, chop this guy down, though. So, uh, I feel like we may be able to create some tools shortly. I don't, I don't really know. <laughs> I don't know yet, but I feel like... That's something I'm going to want to do shortly. I'm going to need food, obviously, too. Maybe a mashed, mashed, mashed sapling is actually food. Hopefully, I'm going to be able to... Oh, no. Oh, no. I'm going to have to build up. So... Oh, God. Yes, we're going to build up. I guess we'll build up three blocks. Because I'm going to want to destroy all the parts of the tree as well. But, yeah. I don't like being up so high. I feel like I'm going to end up falling. This is a really big tree. I feel like I got really lucky on this one. Oh my god, I'm going to have to continue to build up. Wow, look how big this tree is. Because this will probably yield me um, quite a few things. So we did just burn out all of our bone meal. But I think this is good. This is okay. Because after using all that bone meal, hopefully we'll be able to get quite a bit of wood. Which I imagine is going to be a very useful resource early on. And uh, we'll be able to get quite a few saplings. Which I imagine is also going to be a really useful resource early on. So uh, we just got to be careful. I know it's got to be getting nighttime soon. So... Uh, Hopefully that doesn't like end up biting us in the butt and uh, hopefully we don't die because that, that would be really bad and uh, I obviously don't want to die. So I mean, worst case scenario, we could hide up here. I'll cut that part of the video out if we have to hide all night like that. Again, hopefully we won't have to do that, but uh, I don't know. I'd rather be prepared for the worst than, you know, not. So I'm going to try and climb. Should I try and jump on that one? That's kind of scary. Um, actually, no, it's not. It's not that bad if I just, after I destroy this one. Yeah, that's... It, oh my god! Really? Did I just do that? Oh my god, I'm an idiot. I'm, a, I'm down to four hearts, and it's, it is turning nighttime. Alright, so we're gonna leave the remainder of this tree alive. Because, clearly, we just have to get seven saplings. Come on. Come on, saplings, man. Saplings, man. Saplings? Saplings! Okay, we need one. Wait, we need one more. We need one more. I'm gonna have to make some planks, aren't I? Oh, oh, okay, we got nine. Okay, okay, it's fine. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. You gotta be kidding me. Oh. 
Okay, are there skeletons? There probably are. All right, we're gonna we're gonna hide right here. And uh, so, what do I, what does it say now? Um, water bottle. Use craft mesh. Uh, then place the mesh sapling inside a fluid extractor. Hold the empty bucket, and you got it. And voila, water. Remember to look up the recipes in the CM guide. So we're gonna put this thing in here. We're gonna put the nine oak saplings we did receive. And oh, oh, you know what might happen though. Um, let's see, we got a fluid extractor in here. Oh, I could eat this. Um, I think I'm supposed to, right? I mean, probably. I can't, like, take any damage. <laughs> or I'm gonna die. Um, boop. Oh, I need an empty water bottle. Oh, so I could drink this, I imagine. And yes, my hydration does- My hydration went up once? Wait, what do I do with this? Uh, for- Hold a empty bucket. Oh. I wasn't supposed to do that. <laughs> I was supposed to do empty bucket. Hold an empty bucket while next to it. Wait, what? Hold an empty bucket when next to it and voila, water. Remember the recipes that seem good. Then play it. Am I missing something? What's this button do? I don't know. Um, this whole hold a bucket thing isn't working. Uh, I'm on the right version, right? Can I do that? Because I remember people saying they had like certain glitches. I kind of want to use this. I want to keep this with me just in case. I, I want to be safer than not. So it has a power three, whatever the hell this thing is. And oh my god, look at this. This is this is nice. I like it. So. Uh, I don't know where we seem to be trapped and um, well I guess this is as good a point as any to uh, call it quits I'll try and figure out why this isn't working and um, yeah so when I come back we'll, uh, we'll continue on I just blew into the mic really badly but yeah so I hope you guys did enjoy this first part I hope you guys got a taste for what the series will be if you want to see more make sure to leave a like if we get 50 likes on this video I'll try and make the next one um you know half hour 45 minutes long we'll make it a bit longer to uh you know maintain the interest so I thank you guys for watching I do hope you enjoyed and I hope to see you all next time